Hello, my Libras. Welcome back once again. <laughs> okay, so you know the deal. It's a general reading. Take what resonates. If you would like to book a personal reading with me, a link to my website is in the description box below. All right. What I'm going to do today, first, I'm going to take some general messages for Libra that the universe wants to say to you or advice, whatever. We'll see what we get. Um, and then after a look into the person you're dealing with, romantic or not, only you will know if this is a friend, a brother, a lover, I don't know, a workmate, who knows, a workmate, <laughs> um, what that person wants to say to you and what you want to say to this person. It's Mercury retrograde, so I thought that might be a little bit funky <laughs> and fun, perhaps. Um, we'll see what we get. Um, so in the pre-shuffle I was picking up, um, I just keep thinking like, Libra, look at you looking good at home. <laughs> There's something about you that's, uh, whether this is money or financial, if this is not now, it could be coming up. I've seen a balancing out for you, just the way you like it, you know? Some of you may get, I'm hearing, residual income. Uh, some of you may work from home, and so I'm just seeing like steady orders or products. I'm just seeing things coming in for you, abundance, a balancing out, especially in your home life. You look good here. That's all I keep thinking about. Like, woo, Libra looks good sitting at home. All cute. You could have some new clothes. I don't know. Some of you may, I keep wanting to say dye your hair or dye your hair darker or, some, or your hair may be darkening, but it looks really good. Whatever your change you make to yourself is going to look really good. Now, I don't know why I'm picking up hair specifically, but anyway, so looking good here. <laughs> That's what I'm feeling. All right, universe, give me some messages or, and or advice for my Libras, please. What messages do you have for Libra? What messages do you have for Libra, please? Okay. <clears throat> They're saying that you have had strength in times of hardship. Some of you could have grown up poor in your life. Or you could have financial trouble right now. It just depends. Um, if you if you are, I sense that that will be ending. I'm seeing you standing on your own very well. I'm seeing things kind of flowing again. So I don't feel like it would be that much longer. Maybe four to six weeks, things could start to balance out a little bit more. Um, <clears throat> but I am seeing you walking away from financial hardship, from feeling left out, deprived, depleted in your life. I'm just seeing a strength here. You have... Um, the Archangel Michael. Somebody else got this as well, I, I think. Um, I can't remember who though. But anyway, um, having strength on your journey here. You have what it takes to go through it. I feel like you have been on this battle for a long time. And it could have, your path that you have chosen to take could have affected your finances. But there was a, there's a higher calling to something that you're doing um, I'm just getting a lot of strength for you, but walking away from times like that, there could be um, a connection as well that you had to walk away from or you've had to take some distance from um, or you will and this could make you, if that happens, it could be a connection where you weren't feeling fully loved. And if that happened, or if that happens, it, it's for the best because things are gonna balance out for you. Now, this doesn't have to be, I'm not sensing like a falling out completely. I'm just sensing about like loving yourself and really kind of getting into what you have to do to yourself, especially if you don't feel satisfied um, with what's going on for you. Another message for, nope, too many. We don't need six cards. Um, they're encouraging you to follow your heart. Again, this reminds me of a different reading. You could be dealing with another person. That doesn't help because I don't remember the sign. But anyway, I'm, I'm feeling like a balancing out, really working on balancing. That's, you know, the Libra, your energy, taking that energy of yours 
Um, and I think that there is going to be love offered to you or something very emotionally fulfilling as, as a reward for having strength in the times and keep, keep moving. You kept going. You didn't let poverty stop you. You didn't let feeling lonely stop you for whichever one applies. Because you can, you can have money and feel, and feel impoverished inside. There's, they're different, but the same. I see a balancing coming though for you. After some heartbreak, there could be, um, there could be like a water sign that either broke your heart or that you argue with or something like, I'm just seeing like a water sign kind of giving you shit here. <laughs> oh, pardon me. <laughs> I'm not supposed to be, well, whatever, excuse me. That came out though. <laughs> that was what somebody is giving you ish or have in, had in the past. <laughs> I couldn't help it. It's good. Okay, um, all right, so universe, show me what does the person Libra is dealing with? What do they want to say to Libra, please? What does this person want to say to Libra? They could be hot-tempered, I'm feeling. What does this person want to say to Libra? <laughs> what does this person want to say? Okay, hold on. They might be kind of afraid to deal with you because you could be a little bit cutthroat right now to them or very, you know, I'm sensing that you've disconnected from emotional, like it'd be harder to pull on your heartstrings now. You're very like, yes, how may I help you? Are you here to waste my time? Let me ask you that. Are you here to waste my time? <laughs> yeah, they're viewing you as a little bit hard to approach. What do they want to say to Libra here? Again, here's more water energy, the King of Cups. They love you. They want to say that they love you. They, may, they might want to apologize for something. They might want to be more committed. And at, at one point, you could have been waiting for them for a while to make a decision on something, but they could have been not moving or a little bit, you know, mysterious with you. Now, they may also be, they may decide to make a choice. They may decide something about this connection, like they can't get you off of their mind. Something about like not being able to get you off of their mind or you can't get a water sign off of your mind i'm just seeing a lot of i mean this person has a lot of emotional feelings for you they feel like this connection is very strong some of i'm hearing blessed as well so some of them might actually view this as like some sort of higher guidance which i think that there is something going on here there's something to be learned but I'm just seeing like them realizing like, wow, this person, like, I think I'm supposed to be with this person. But there's a lot of fogginess in between your heads. So you may just not get each other or in the past, you, I, I'm just feeling like there could have been a lot of fighting. But again, they may want to apologize to you. They may want to express love. They may want to try to be a little bit more by the book and balanced to you, like give, you what you want but I, I sense that they might also be a little bit hesitant I don't see them moving I see them kind of waiting and thinking about this choice um, oh yes well let's let's go here shall we all right so what does Libra want to say to this person what does Libra want to say to this person please Libra want to say to this person, please? Libra. What do you want to say, Libra? You know, it's interesting because you may feel a little bit trapped in your head over this person. I think you're thinking of them as well. I think that the Three of Pentacles here, you may want to build something, but you don't... I'm feeling like 
The Three of Pentacles is can be friendship, but it's also building, working together. So I think in regard, I don't really see, you know, either one of you outwardly saying something to each other. That This person over here is just thinking about it, thinking about realizing some things because they can't get you off their mind. And, and you over here kind of like, um, I think you do want to work together. I think you do want to heal this connection ideally, but only if there's an actual working and building together here. You know, this person is by themselves in this photo and the three of pentacles is about working together. So in the past, it could have felt like, um, am I the only one that cares about building this relationship or working this out? You know, and I don't think you have interest in being alone, feeling alone in this project or this connection. So that's what you could be thinking about. But I think this is actually something that you ideally, you know, this person was your wish. You asked for this person at one point in time. You wanted to work together with them, and I think you do, sort of. But there's something about the slow energy or the, the just the slow progress, the closed off energy that could have, you know, fluffed this situation up. What else does Libra want to say to this person? Well... I think working together and being with this person, building-wise, you may have a child with them or you might in the future, depending on if you guys decide to heal and work this out. I see you being willing to work with this individual because you see potential. Um, there's love here. There's emotional expression. And I think that there's, you may go on a trip together, I want to say, to the coast or like to somewhere where there's like tropical um uh, plants or flowers or something if it's not tropical then it could be like desert like you know how the desert has some really interesting flowers i'm just seeing like bright colors here so it's either i know those are two separate locations but i am seeing like going towards going somewhere together healing this there is hope in this situation if the other person however this whatever energy flip-flop it whatever somebody has to realize that this connection, even though there's been misunderstandings, which I think it's the other energy, but it doesn't really matter. They have to realize what this partnership is and be more committed to it and be more loving and deep with it. And Because I, I feel like that's the only way that the other individual is going to want to work and build this. They don't want to work alone. They don't want to be in a relationship by themselves. It's very lonely. So, yeah, no, heartbreak. Could have been you that felt like, uh, yeah, doing it alone. That's what I'm kind of sensing. One more card, please. Ooh, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Well, balance. So, again, on your side, you just want balance. Same theme of what I was saying. But you know what's interesting? You know what I like about this is that the Justice card has come up on both ends. So there might be a realization. I don't see any movement quite yet, but I'm seeing people realize, both sides realizing there needs to be balance in this. There needs to be a high level of commitment in order to be, in order to make this connection happy, basically. Whether or not you wanna to move towards this, again, I'm not seeing any movement, but I am seeing people making decisions about what this is and what it what it has potential to be if that makes sense bringing balance back into this connection both sides are beginning to realize or they will probably a little bit after the retrograde though it's it's hairy right now but anyway that's what i have for you libra good luck and goodbye <laughs>